What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Orthoxy and welcome back today to Crazy Craft. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. So today, once again, we've got a few little plans here for stuff that I want to do. So I think what we're going to begin with here is I'm really, really like hung up on these inventory pets. Now, I'm sure if you've been watching the series so far, you'll know that I've been searching all over the shop for some of these really rare ones. And so far not very good. Um, but what I wanted to do to begin with here is I wanted to actually craft a few of the cooler looking um, sort of ones that you can make. I think we're just going to play about with them, give them a little go, and then maybe later on in the episode we will go and like, I don't know, I kind of, I I'm a slightly addicted to Pac-Man killing, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I love it because, you know, just the random items is, I've said this before, but it's like opening Pokemon cards. You never quite know what you are going to get. And sometimes, if you're lucky, you might get some awesome stuff. But maybe we'll also go to some cloud dungeons and take a look around. Now, last episode, I did mention that we were going to be taking a look pretty soon at all of the superhero stuff. So, I don't think we're going to do that this episode. And the reason why is I want to build an area in my base dedicated to the superheroes mod. So, I'm not 100% sure where I want to put it, to be honest with you. Um, see, we've got, like, this area here, of course. So, down here we have, um, the Fancy Lantern Room. Oh, speaking of which, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, once again, boom! Oh, I put it in the wrong spot, hang on. <laughs> Um, boom! Yeah, there we go. Thank you so, so much for achieving the 10,000 likes on last episode. You guys are just, you blow me away with the series. Seriously, it's really, really awesome. So, once again, if we can try and hit over 10,000 likes, that would be absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, your support is genuinely very appreciated, and I mean that very sincerely. So, uh, yeah, thank you so much, guys. Once again, your nice reward here. I'll give you this nice green one, and now this is funny because... I forgot to mention this, and I've been meaning to mention this for ages, but um, thank you so much to everyone as well for all of your amazing fan art that you've been sending in. I've been noticing recently on Twitter and on Instagram and stuff, I've been tagged in, and loads of people are sending me in incredible fan art of not just me as well, of Dan and Justin and all of us together, and even... Fancy Lantern fan art. Yes, it exists. It is out there. It is amazing. Um, <laughs> and as well as that, people are like tweeting me pictures of real life Fancy Lanterns, which they find in their homes and on their travels. It's amazing. We have created something truly horrible here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, just thank you very much. I love all the fan art and stuff. I really, really appreciate it. Um, but okay, so anyway, yeah, as I was saying, I don't really know where I want to put it. So we've got the inventory pets down here and we've got like a nice little enchanting room. Oh, another question is, should I enchant the queen scale? Because like it looks pretty cool as black and red, but with like the kind of purpley glow on it, it could also look really cool. I know like if I put it in the enchanting bench that it will probably be random and most of them might be rubbish, but... We can always, like, add to that and change that with uh, enchantment books as and when we find them. Uh, but yeah, anyway, so this is kind of like the area, obviously, that we do that sort of stuff in. And then we've got the armory over here, which has just basically loads and loads of random swords and weapons and stuff that we've picked up on our travels. And then if we go back over here, of course, I'm giving you, like, a little bit of an informal tour. Nothing really has changed. But obviously down here is our basic witchery area just for doing potions and brewing. We've got our main witchery area, of course, in this circle of trees. Uh, but this is kind of good just for some basic bits and pieces. We've got another shrine here, which is just under 9,000. So not too bad, not too bad. Um, and then, of course, down here... Da -da 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 -da, we have our enchanting... Uh, this is not an enchanting room. This is a storage room. We have an owl in here. He really likes this room. <laughs> and, of course, the secret wall. And we go down here and we have our equivalent exchange setup. So I want to do a different layer. And I'm fully aware that there are so many superhero stuffs here. Um, how do I... What's the best way of doing this? Armor, maybe? No. Chest? Uh, I'm trying to show you. Yeah, like you've got, like, Iron Man, and you've got, um, Superman, and you've just got everything. It's crazy. I know a lot of people have recommended me trying to get the Superman outfit, because apparently that's one of the better ones. But, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, what was I doing down here again? Oh, yeah, inventory pets. So the first one I was looking at here was the moon pet, and this reverses gravity of mobs and items, which I thought sounded really, really cool. So we need an emerald, diamond, uh, nether quartz, and a ghast tier. Ooh, a ghast tier. Now that might be slightly tricky, actually. Oh, did I? If I had one, I could equivalent exchange it. 
But I don't think I have one, so maybe we need to take a little trip to the nether again. And, um... Oh, that's really annoying, isn't it? I thought I had one. I've got one in here somewhere that looks like a gas tier, but it's not. It's an angel tier, uh, which was from the Weeping Angels. So, have I not got a single gas tier? Are you kidding? No! Oh, there's a fancy lantern in here as well. What are you doing in here? A brown fancy lantern. Could you get more fancy? Probably. Um, yeah, that's annoying. Okay, well, I guess we can take a little quick trip to the nether, I guess. Let's see if we can find some Pac-Man. Uh, but we need a gas tier, so I have my ultimate bow. I don't have it. Uh, <laughs> what do I do with it? Hey, there's one. I will take that one. Happy days. So, uh, let's take a little stroll over to the portal. I know I have the TARDIS and I have the... Um, the the thingamajig pet, the, 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 the portal pet. Actually, you know what? The portal pet might be quite useful. You know what? No, no, no. Screw it. We're, we're going to go this way. We're, we're going to go the old-fashioned way. Um, but yeah, just a quick one, really. Um, in terms of, like, other games and stuff that you would like to see on the channel, if you have any suggestions and stuff, then please let me know. Um, so, ooh, hello. Are you, are you a coven witch or are you just a regular? Oh, God, you're a regular. Ooh, die! Yes! Yeah! Oh, the sword is too powerful. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, if you have any suggestions and stuff, then definitely let me know. Uh, I'm always happy to kind of hear your suggestions and stuff. So, in terms of what we're playing uh, recently on the channel, of course, we have the YouTubers Live series. Now, I don't know how long you guys want me to go on that because I think we're at episode 14 and we're doing pretty well in that. But... Um, we also have the Roblox, which I've begun recently, uh, which I'm loving. I'm really, really liking the Roblox content. And, um, what else are we doing? Oh, yeah, we played a bit of chicken recently, which was awesome. Um, and then, yeah, we just kind of, we did some Five Nights at Freddy's World, but unfortunately, we pretty much completed everything. Oh, God, you stay away from me. You stay away from me. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. See, this is the one. Look, look, look. See, this looks like a gas tier, but it's actually called... Uh, what does it do? Oh. Oh, can I set day and night with that? That's really nifty. I thought it was a teleportation thing. Huh. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Okay, so I thought it was like a random teleport thing, a bit like kind of like a strange ender pearl, but obviously maybe not. Well, we'll try and get another one of those. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of looking for something, you know, new and different to play. Um, but it has to kind of be something that people really want to see, I guess, because, um, you know, I want, it, I want it to be able to appeal. And I want it to give you like an alternative to the Minecraft content. Although having said that, I am loving the Minecraft content at the moment. Because it's not just the crazy craft, but it's kind of like, you know, I always love the adventure maps and stuff. Um, and I'm, I've been huge into adventure maps pretty much since I started doing Minecraft content. In fact, my first ever Minecraft video, I believe, was an adventure map. And it was on, like, 1.4. <laughs> and since then, we've been, you know, loving the adventure maps and stuff. But because the, like, the, 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 what they call the versions have changed to, you know, 1.9 and then 1.10 and stuff. Uh, it does take a little while for map developers to get their maps out and stuff. So, you know, things like the find my button maps and the find the button and that kind of thing, they're quite popular right now and I'm really enjoying them, but I'm always looking for an alternative and stuff uh, to throw something new out there. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna have a little poke about here, see what I can find. I need to find a ghast, but yeah, if you have any suggestions, then let me know. Okay, I found what I'm looking for. Oh my goodness, though. Like, I... Oh, God. No, no, no. <laughs> you stay there. Stay there, Mr. Lava. Um, yeah, like, this armor is good. Don't get me wrong. But I take so much damage from fire. There's no, like... Because there's no fire resistance or anything on it. Oh, there's a Pac-Man there as well. Yes. <laughs> oh, this is, my, this is my lucky day, isn't it? Okay, let me try and get rid of this gas. Come here. Yes. Did I get him? No, no, one more, one more. So yeah, this whole place is on fire, and it's doing a lot of fire damage to me because I've got no enchant. So I, I definitely think enchanting this would be a good idea, right? Oh, it's gone miles away. Come on, give me that tear, give me that tear. And we're going to go and grab that. Um, oh, no, 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 no. James, James, don't die with the good armor. Oh, oh no, it didn't just drop into the lava, did it? Oh, that would just be my luck. Come on, no, 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 no. Did it, did it, did it? I think it did. <laughs> oh, come on. I just found... Oh, they take ages to find ghasts. Especially in this mod pack. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, never mind. We're going to have to find another one. But fortunately, we have a lovely Mr. Pac-Man here, which will make everything okay. So come on, come on. Am I got... I feel really slow. Come on. Go, 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 go. Don't want to knock you off the edge. Is there any lava? No, I don't think there is. Okay, that's fine. Let's go and get you. Kill it. Yes. 
Okay, what are we gonna get? What are we? Oh no, hang on, steady, steady. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? That looks like a load of rubbish. Let's go check it out. We got a mithril mace, a steel tower shield, an amethyst sword, a muddy helmet, and some. Yeah, that was rubbish. Oh, oh, a slime donut though. I will eat you. Appears to be some kind of slime glitched here in the wall, and boom, we have ourselves the return to sender achievement. Amazing. I swear we already had that, did we not? That's really strange. Okay, so where is your beautiful- No, not another- <laughs> It's not dropped in the lava again, has it? Oh, you're joking me. Why is- Oh. <laughs> That's so annoying. Everywhere I go, the drops go into- I think so, oh, unless it just didn't drop one, which it may have not done. Oh, all right, one more. I'm gonna find this gas tier. Please. All right, come on. Don't let me down on this one, buddy. <laughs> I really, really want your gas tier. Come on, come on. Stay away from the lava. I know what you're gonna try and do to me. Yes, get over here, get over here. And come on, one more, one more, one more. Woohoo! Did you drop what I want? Did you drop it? Yes, woohoo! Yeah, finally! Oh, that is going straight into equivalent exchange when we get back. Does it have a value? It does. 4,000, which is quite expensive, but it doesn't matter because we've got a ton of ores and stuff. Finally! So now that we've got that, we don't need to worry about it again. Um, but whilst I'm here and we're in the nether because, you know, when in the nether... Go and look for Pac-Man, right? I do know, by the way, that um, people keep telling me, and I appreciate that, of course. Uh, there's loads and loads of Pac-Man in the end dimension. Uh, it's just, I think Justin ages ago sort of mentioned that we should maybe do the end together and kill the Ender Dragon together, just as sort of a fun thing to do. So I'm avoiding going there just because... Um, maybe we'll be able to do that together in the future. So just thought I'd let you guys know, but of course there's Pac-Man in the overworld as well, but I tend to find more of them in these. And um, they usually spawn in like groups of three. It's mad. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a little bit of a wonder. We're going to kill maybe just one group of Pac-Man if we can find some, and then we'll go and head back and do some sweet lady crafting. So does that sound good? Yes, amazing. See you in a minute. Yeah, that's what we need. Woohoo, look at that. Oh, I think there's what? One, two, three. Amazing. That is perfect. Okay, okay, okay. So let's get rid of these guys. I could actually do with some food because to be honest, I've ran out. So let me get rid of one. Nice. Loads of items dropping. Let me get rid of the others. Yes, there's one. And then can I get the other one? Oh. Um, well... Where do we even begin? Ladies and gentlemen, it is the next day here, IRL, and I kind of left you on a little bit of a cliffhanger there. At one point, we were at the nether, and we were killing some Pac-Man. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I broke the server. Yes, I did. Oh, why do things like this always happen to me? Like, seriously. <laughs> As soon as I broke it, I was once again like, Justin, help, please, what have I done? And yeah, I don't know what happened. This was so weird. So I was killing those Pac-Man and then as you saw, like my game just crashed. And then every single time I reloaded it up, as soon as I opened my inventory, the game crashed again. And I couldn't actually open my inventory at all without it crashing. So the only thing that I can think of is that maybe Pac-Man dropped some kind of item that was bugged, and then every single time I tried to open it, basically, we crashed. So I had to roll back the server, and I had to go and get the gas tier again, but it's all good because... Ah, we have it. And as well as that, because it's the next day, I've, I've made a few more inventory pets here. So we're going to be making the moon pet, which was the whole point of our adventure. But I did make a few of the other ones here. So I made the bed. I made the brewing stand. Brews a random potion. No way. Oh, wow. That's really good. Okay, so that eats nether wart. But wow, that's really useful, actually. We got the pingot pet, <laughs> which I thought was pretty cool. Ping. Ping? What, why wouldn't you ping? Uh, sonar ping to find ores. Why wouldn't you ping? Okay, that's pretty rubbish. Um, I think it needs to be closer underground. I bought the purplicious. I didn't buy it. I made it. The purplicious cow pet and the furnace pet as well. Uh, but yeah, let's go and make the moon pet. Man, I can't believe that. I can't be trusted. I've burned down the server. I've crashed the server. Everything is going wrong. Everything is going wrong. But you know what? Let's soldier through here. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Okay, okay. So, what do we need here for this moon pet? 
Uh, gas tier, okay, that's pretty straightforward, actually. Um, so let's grab that stuff, and then let's go to La Table Sur Le Crafting, which is definitely not the French for it. Um, and then let's go like that, let's go like that, let's go like that, woohoo! <laughs> the moon pads, yeah! So this reverses gravity of mobs and items. I totally want to go and try this out. Should we do it? Uh, let's try and find, oh, I tell you what we can do. Oh, this could be so fun. We have tons and tons of animals over here in our area that we used um, to summon Rite of Bestial Calls. So there's like loads of them grouped up. Uh, my duplicator tree seems to have stopped working, which is a little bit annoying. I was doing some redstone and some uh, surprise ore, but I'm sure I can kick that back up. <gasps> Ronald, the surprise pig. Do you remember him? He's got the, <laughs> He's the one with the turtle on his head. Oh, disappointing turtles. Okay, okay, okay. So... What should we do? Should we go here? Yeah, this seems about right. So I'm going to drop a couple of items on the floor as well to try this out. Come on. Yes, 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 yes. And if we do it like that. <laughs> Whoa! They go up so high. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Do they drop? Do they... Yes, they do. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that is insane. Oh man, I really want to try this. Mobs and items. I wonder if this works on other players. Because if it is, I could like walk up to walk up to Dan or Justin or whatever and levitate them. Is it gonna levitate this massive spider? That's the question. <laughs> it is! What? Whoa, isn't that awesome? That's so cool. Oh my goodness, I love this. I absolutely love this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and they come back down to Earth. Wow, the moon pet is amazing. That is so, so fun. So, of course, this took kind of like a little bit of a, a strange twist because I wasn't really thinking that we were going to crash the server here today. Um, but... Yeah, I think all in all, that's amazing. I love this. I'm actually going to be using this. So, oh... Ooh, would this be useful for, like, dungeons and stuff? Oh, I suppose they wouldn't go through the top of the, um, top of the rocks. But if there was, like, a ton of hard mobs in front of us, we could use the moon pet and then levitate them. And then we could, like, go and run and get the goodies in, like, a chest or something. That's so cool. All right, okay, okay. Let's put down our bits and... Oh, hello. Opal Wild, do you just live here now? Is that something Is that something that I've agreed to, apparently? I've just got this one coven witch. She just chills in the house. <laughs> I didn't remember us telling you you could move in, buddy, but all right, fine. Whatever, whatever. So let's go and put these in our collection. I love the moon pet, um, and I think we're definitely going to be using that. That's kind of one that I think I could put. <gasps> no, I didn't put the gas tier in my equivalent exchange. Oh, no, James. Why? I've got to get another one now. Oh, fine. Whatever. <laughs> Alright, next episode. Well, I'll, I'll do it for next episode. I'll go and get another nether star. Uh, sorry, not a nether star. A, um, uh, a thingy eye. Uh, no, not a, a, a tear. Yes. Whew. Got there eventually. Oh, I've already got a bed pet. Oops. Why did I make two? Annoying. Um, so let's put the pink one here. Boop. Boop. Oh, can you hear that? It made a little beeping. That's interesting. Okay, furnace pet. We definitely don't have one of those. So I'm going to put that there. Brewing stand pet I'm going to put here because I like them to be nice and colorful. I'm going to put the purplicious cow there. And I guess for now, we'll put the moon pet down here. But I'm probably going to be using that. That's really, really awesome. Um, So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so, so much for checking out this crazy craft episode. Didn't go quite to plan, but you know what? It was fun nonetheless. So uh, yeah, if we can try and please hit that 10,000 like goal, that would be absolutely insane. So thank you so, so much once again, very sincerely for your continued support of the series. And of course, for the channel. And also, if you're not yet subscribed, go for it. Because we do Minecraft. Done fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. See ya.